Man, I'm one disgruntled 911 call attendant. I'm a not too happy 911 dispatcher. People keep calling 911 over stupid reasons. That phone line is for life or death emergencies, not a complete hotline. This isn't Jerry Springer. This isn't Mari. To hell with you people. Seriously, there could be an armed robbery, a stroke victim, or a house that's on fire, and the police, fire, or EMT can't make it because some of these dumbasses holding up the lines to complain about messed up orders at Wendy's, McDonald's, Subway, or even at damn Burger King. What the hell? It makes me so hungry when people use 911 to complain about their orders at restaurants getting botched. I really don't understand what makes anybody really think the police will come to arrest a mcdonald's worker because they are a couple of fries short of a happy meal seriously though recently some woman was so mad about her chicken sandwich at kfc that the broad had the nerve to call 911 because of it i mean what the fuck do you think the police are going to do woman arrest colonel sanders because you don't like her sandwich Let's also share several other stupid reasons people have called into 911 over their dumbass botched fast food orders. This one time, a woman was so mad at Subway because they put marinara sauce instead of pizza sauce in her order. Shakes my damn head. No, really, you're going to hold up real emergencies because you don't like marinara sauce and think it's more important than attending to a victim of a head-on collision on the road? Jesus, lady. This stupid bitch was locked up by the police for 30 minutes because they considered it a waste of police officers' time to arrest. And these morons who use 911 for fast food order complaints should be charged. I can't stand these junk food morons. Another time, there was this nincompoop who ordered seven cheeseburgers and when he found out he was a burger short, this a-hole actually called 911. Now let me figure this one out. You're calling 911 over a missing cheeseburger? Please man, go get a life. Just eat those seven cheeseburgers and get an instant heart attack, you damn glutton. Years ago, a 42-year-old man called in the 911 over three times because somehow Subway forgot to put mayonnaise and mustard on his spicy Italian sub. Seriously, is that such a big emergency to bring the police all the way down to Subway to fix a sandwich, sir? Not to mention the dumbass who went nuts on everyone yelling at the employees and customers throwing around chairs until they locked the door on him when he went outside to call the police. On call number three, he was wondering what the police or why the police was taking so damn long. When the police actually arrived, they actually escorted him away. I hope they had locked him up. Hey dumbass, the police are trying to stop a bank robbery. Your sandwich isn't important to them. When they did show up, however, as I've said before, they arrested the idiot for misuse of 911 service. We were all there saying, thank you, Lord. Some 9 or 10 years ago, some crack whore called 911 because McDonald's was out of chicken McNuggets and they wanted to give her a McDouble instead. But she wanted a full monetary refund and when they didn't give it to her, she called, guess what? She called 911 over damn chicken McNuggets. I'd personally prefer to have jumped over the counter and beat the shit out of the employees rather than making an ass out of myself over a completely unnecessary 911 call. Then again, they'd probably have called the police on me too afterwards after I beat the shit out of that employer. A Burger King customer, again, Complained to 911 that they were out of lemonade. I mean, seriously, is your damn lemonade that more important than a heart attack victim or a forest fire? Not to mention a 911 call over the lack of shrimp in fried rice. I think I've heard it all. Seriously, you think that's about as illegal as drug procession?
I often wonder where the intelligence of this good old United States that I live in has gone. Because some of these people are real dumbasses. Another 911 call and guess what? He thought McDonald's robbed him of his money after the employee told him to wait for them to complete his order. This dumbass was so high on crack and was so impatient that he did actually call into 911. He even went as far as threatening our 911 dispatchers by cussing them out and even told them that Ronald McDonald was holding a gun at his head. Face palm. Yes. He was actually higher on crack than how a NASA satellite actually orbits the Earth. The police actually showed up and arrested the idiot. And even after he was still bitching about his food claiming they have gotten him arrested over a simple ass $10 order. No dumbass, you got yourself arrested for a blatant misuse of 911 services. And unless McDonald's was actually on fire, you had no reason to have call in. It is really stupid that people use 911 for stupid and selfish reasons. Next time, if you find yourself in a life and death situation and you can't get help, it's because some of these fucktards like these aforementioned people are holding up the lines because they are not satisfied with their fast food orders. It's idiots like these who shouldn't even be allowed to have phones since they don't even know how to use 911 properly. But then again, how hard is 911 to use? Anyway guys, there's much more worse than I've mentioned above. But I'll write back another time about even more dumbass encounters of the weird kind. Till the next time, this is a gruntled 911 dispatcher. Tell us what you think. Leave a comment below and subscribe.